Hello guys, it's Lucas the Transformers Skyfire slash Prowl fan here, and today I am going to be doing some more explaining. In Transformers G1, there are three Seekers, and, and one of them is the one who is fully convinced that he is not on the right side and has the power of Sonic Booms comes the Sonic Boom and Decepticon Seeker, Thundercracker. And he, Thundercracker is very characterized as, um, the dude who, um, soars through the skies and would battle any creature that would be unable to take flight. And he uses his uh, sonic booms and his laser guns. However, he is not fully convinced to the Decepticon cause. He only stuck with them for a purpose in life. Thundercracker was one of the main characters through the Transformers G1 animated series, voiced by John Stevenson, usually alongside his close friend Skywarp. And basically, just like that. And Thundercracker was the main character of its cast throughout its first two seasons. And, but Thundercracker's toy was discontinued in 1986, which led him to be killed off in both the Marvel Comics, which he was scrapped by Omega Supreme, and in the Transformers G1 movie, which he was injured in battle, jettisoned into space, and had his remains recreated by the monster planet Unicron into the fearsome hacker Scourge. However, Thundercracker would return to life in the Marvel comics, but as quickly as he reappeared, he was killed once more by a cosmic-powered Starscream. And technically, while Thundercracker was absent from the Transformers Beast Wars series, until he did make another appearance into Transformers Armada, but this appearance was actually different. Instead of being Thundercracker, it was a recolored as Starscream. And Thundercracker was also introduced into Transformers Cybertron. I don't know about Transformers Energon, though. However, the next appearance of Thundercracker was introduced in 2008, Transformers Animated. This Thundercracker was one of the clones of Starscream, like Skywarp. And also, you guys, if you missed my Skywarp's retrospective, make sure you go check that out, too. But anyway, this Thundercracker was a clone of Starscream. And basically, him and Skywarp was um, sucked into a space bridge. And stuff like that. Well, anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on that bell for notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And peace, y'all. Peace.